As a business owner, how many times have you heard this one? Work on your business, not in it. Well, if you're like many business owners, you've heard this so many times, it doesn't even register anymore. So what exactly does it mean to work on your business versus in it? My definitions are pretty simple. Working in your business, that's performing activities that have to happen to keep your doors open. And working on your business is performing activities that aren't required to operate your business day to day, but are required to grow it over the long term. Examples of working in your business include sales and marketing, production, order fulfillment, customer service, paying the bills, sending invoices, doing payroll, checking time slips. It might be sweeping and vacuuming. It might be wiping down the tables. All the things that just keep the doors open. These and anything else that must be done to obtain or service your customers. Simply put, the work of the business, both the product service delivery and then the overhead activities to support it. Now some examples of working on your business include planning, whether it's this week, this month, 90 day like we do, one year, three year, budgeting, working on your vision, your mission, developing your culture and your core values in your business, leading your team, managing your team, coaching your team, developing hiring and training systems, systemizing your business. So you can run a business successfully up to a point without allocating almost any time at all for these activities but you will eventually hit a wall or ceiling that you just can't get past unless you start allocating time for these on your business activities. If you need any help coming up with how you can find the time to work on your business, give us a shout and one of our coaches will be happy to sit down with you and brainstorm in a strategy session how to work on your business more and work in it less. Make it a great day and see you soon. Thanks, bye.